it will be an evening that will, will spark something in you. It will have an effect on you, it'll touch your emotions, touch your spirit, because it is a different experience from anything else. It's not a symphony orchestra, it's not a chamber orchestra, it's not a quartet. It, we are completely unique. It's not just a one-dimensional event of coming and just watching people playing. There's a, there's a, you know, there's a real sort of occasion about it. You just buy your ticket for 10 quid and you can sit wherever you like and you know, the whole concert experience is, is quite relaxed. Hopefully by making it just standard £10, that will entice lots more people to, to come along. This season, uh, we, we carry on the pattern of touring that, that we've established in the past and which works really well for us, which is to visit all the main Scottish cities, Aberdeen and Inverness and Perth and Dundee, Edinburgh, Glasgow, and then uh, we have our London residency at Wigmore Hall. I guess the concert experience in the end is, is very powerful because we've kind of lived with this music uh, for quite a long period of time uh, and, and we're very passionate about sharing what we've sort of been learning about all this great music with, with our audience. You know, there's such a, a fantastic group of people, brilliant players throughout, and that really just creates this great atmosphere. The violins and violas all stand up, which makes it more immediate. Our repertoire is it's like a selection box. You, you, know, you don't know what you're going to get each time. It's very, very different, and I think that's really stimulating. Every year there's some terrific people who come in and play with us. Um, this last season we've just played with Anthony Marwood and it was just wonderful, wonderful violin playing. And the one that stands out for me in this forthcoming season is Lawrence Power. I mean, he must be the world's greatest viola player at the moment. Most of our audiences we find are very open-minded about the programming and they like it when they have something that they don't know that is challenging and, it, you know, it might not be their cup of tea, but they still enjoy it because it's a good performance. In September, we're doing a repeat performance of um, a new commission by uh, James McMillan called Seraph. We performed that earlier on in the year. Um, it's a fantastic piece. Alison Balsam is playing trumpet on it, and she's just fantastic. Turn up and have open ears, open hearts, you know, and, and hopefully we can have a, a great experience together. Mm -hmm.